the AAA title Dying Light recently had a demo released, and in their demo, they made a Linux version too. So I want to see how good the Linux version of this game was and how well it ran on a GTX 750 Ti, which isn't very great hardware. I'd heard when the game came out that they had performance troubles but had been patched, so I want to see just how far along they'd come. So once we're in the main menu, we can go to the options and look at the different graphical settings. I'm running at 1080p and I lowered everything down to the minimum, although surprisingly enough you can't lower texture quality down from medium. And then they like it let you choose the keyboard or mouse. We're using a controller and I'm using a keyboard and a mouse. Once once we're in game and actually playing at lowest settings, the performance is not very good at lowest settings. It's around 45 FPS with drops to 35, 30, 34 and it, it only gets worse from here. It doesn't look that bad considering it's at lowest lowest settings, although the anti-aliasing is very noticeable. But once we get into combat, it makes it pretty hard to play it with really low FPS, although it would be higher when there's no screen recorder running. Maybe I can track them down. Now we're in the game at the high settings, and the performance is not very good. Tw the low 20s is what we're seeing, and this is without any enemies on the screen. Very, almost nothing's on the screen. It's 20 FPS. Then when we jump into real gameplay with even just two zombies on the screen, it's gonna, it drops, and then to 17 FPS, 19 FPS, even worse. It makes it very, very hard to play. So not very good on high settings on this hardware. Without recording, the performance on lowest setting ranges from 45 to 50 frames per second. When I turn up the settings and put it on high, I got around 25 to 30 FPS. While the performance is better than it was with a screen recorder, it isn't exactly impressive. <laughs> 